Here we have a 2010 on a 10 registration Scania K340 Catano Levante 53 seat coach. Vehicle is operated by Skills Group. These vehicles we have advertised before, but they've had a bit of a tidy up and wheels refurbished and a bit of livery put on, and they look better for it. So I thought I'd just give them a bit of a freshen up, really. Um, got a pair. This one's a 53-seater, the other one is still 49 exec. Both 2010s. Body works all good on the offside. At the business end, there is a Euro 5 Scania engine that's driven through a ZF fully automatic gearbox. Again, back corners, etc all look fine no exterior bodywork issues at all power operated lockers and the good thing about Levantes is loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of luggage space because there's never been a toilet intrusion so you can convert this to a 70 and still do your residentials your PGLs all that sort of stuff you wouldn't have a luggage issue we have LED destination displays to front side and rear we also have a step mounted wheelchair lift as we jump on board 53 seats all with three point seat belts to be honest these seats the half leather they won't be everybody's cup of tea and to be honest I think with the blue curtains if you retrim these in like a blue maquette with blue headrest inserts personally I think they look a million dollars it would just freshen the thing up altogether you'd struggle to think that there was once a toilet here quite a good toilet removal obviously the other one has a rear floor mounted toilet in the corner fully air conditioned All in all, good tool for the job. We've wired for CCTV, as you can see. And for me, you know, for a school vehicle, these Scanias are far better. ZF automatic gearbox, D for, D for go, the jobs are good. Un. These two seats here are on quick release tracking. So that's your wheelchair space. So you drop to 51 plus a wheelchair. Good thing about the Levantes over a lot of PSVR conversions, you only lose one double seat for a wheelchair, where most things you lose two. Um, obviously, they are high mileage, but as I've said many times before, National Express operators tip top on maintenance. They have to be, else they lose the contract. Regularly audited by National Express. Dash is all in good order. We are wired for DVD with one drop down monitor. But uh, I'm actually surprised these vehicles have stuck around so long. I only put it down to lockdown because I think that whilst the seats aren't great, there is a lot of potential for these vehicles. You know, you could retrim them, run them as they are. And Levante's very, very simple being flat floored to up seat to three and two 70 seaters. And being ZF Autos, just for me, that gives them that extra potential. The other one's just over there by the yellow Silverdale coach, EZT. Little bit of a note for that. A lot of you will remember it because it used to run rounding with a big green shamrock on the back. It was one of the Irish uh, St. Patrick's Day National Express coaches. And uh, Corgi released that one as a model. Just a bit of a bit of useless information. So to recap, this is one of a pair of 2010 Scania K340 IB. Catano Levante PSVAR compliant coaches this one a 53 seater the other one a 49 seater with a rear floor mounted toilet